Caroline Saunders speaking, Principal Geological Chemist on Bish National Gas Survey MD 16001. Preliminary results from sample site 2 are promising. We're posting similar concentrations as in the first site. Similar biogas makeup here as well, including a few organic compounds that I'm not familiar with. We've also discovered heavy lye residue in a naturally formed chamber at this excavation site. Lucky we were wearing caustics gear to begin with, or somebody might have suffered some serious chemical burns. I'd like to analyze the site further, see if there's any connection between these compounds and the lye deposits. My tech is telling me he needs a couple of hours to work on our ventilator unit. I suppose I'll move on to site three in the meantime. Further analysis is for my own curiosity anyway. This is my authorization signature on sample site two.
This is Caroline Saunders, Principal Geological Chemist for Bish National Gas Survey MD16001. Sample set one shows promising concentration of biogas in mostly limestone substratum of wetlands. No exact levels yet, but this site should exhibit more than enough extraction potential to meet survey goals. I'm going to leave a couple of interns here to handle the minutia, but it's a formality. I'll move on to the other sites now to make sure this isn't an aberration. Consider this my authorization signature on sample site one. We have multiple flashpoints on horizon. Come back. Air Command, USN 350 requesting landing vector. Have zero ceiling visibility and low on state. Somebody get me a landing clearance. State 1 plus 1, zero to splash. Have zero read on outer marker. This is USN 350. I'm blind out here. Attempting emergency landing over water. INS pinger active on distress band. Flaps up. Descent to eight cherubs. Three green over. 
Five cherubs, tree line up. Throttle easy on four lights. Prepping to pull the loud handle. 